Welcome to Fairtone Studios. I'm going to tell you the best mods for your Fender Telecaster, starting with this one. This control plate has a volume knob which is nearer the rear of the guitar, so when the switch is in the bridge position, there is a gap here. Now a lot of Telecasters don't have that. When you've got it in the bridge position, it's almost touching the volume knob, which isn't as much of a problem when you move the switch to the bridge position, but when you go to move it to the neck and you turn your volume down, it's not very fun. It's not as bad as in a studio situation because you can just redo the take, but live, that's a problem. Put a link to this in the description because it took me ages to source one. The ones with the angled switch sort of help a bit, but this just solves the problem. The next mod I'd recommend is changing the three-way switch to a four-way switch. Why would you want to do that? Well, because when it's in the middle position, it's in parallel, so it sounds like this. Don't get me wrong, that sounds wonderful, but it adds this extra position where both pickups, instead of being in parallel, are in series, so they're more like a humbucker, gives it a bit more output, and it takes a bit of the high end away, but it just, it sounds great. I've done a full video on that mod, so if you want to know how to do that, I'll put a link in the description to that video, um, a card and a box at the end so you can click on it. But I will put up a picture now of the wiring diagram so you know how to wire up a four-way switch. All you'll need is a four-way switch. It just gives your guitar another tonal option and it would really suit someone playing live, well, or definitely in the studio, but if you're playing live and you just want to push your amp that bit harder, you don't need a boost pedal. It just gives it a bit more output and can, if your amp's on the edge of breakup, it can push it more into that breakup, which is quite a nice touch, I think. Now this mod, five-way switch. So we've done a four-way switch and five-way switch is separate. The reason for that is, if you put it in this new position, the five-way switch adds, which is both pickups out of phase, if you do that live, it probably won't sound good for the majority of songs you play. It may be helpful for one song in a set, if that, maybe a couple. In the studio, it's a lot more helpful if you're layering and you think, right, I need another sound. Well, the guitar can do that new sound. It does sound a little bit odd. This is with the tone on full. So as you can hear, it doesn't sound amazing. Again, there's a wiring diagram for you, just in case you want to do it. I have done another full video on that. So again, there's a card, link in the description and an end screen box, there's a full video in case you want to know how to do it. It's a bit more complicated. I would say it's more for someone that's recording guitars and guitar layers though, purely because if you're, you've added a, no, a few normal sounding guitars and you think, well, I want this one to stand out for whatever reason, it just needs a different sound so it's not lost in the mix. There's your sound that can do that. Your guitar can do the single coil sound, you know, normal Telecaster sound. You can put it in the, the four-way switch extra position, which this has, where the two pickups in series, so they sound like a humbucker, bit of extra output. And then you can put it in the five-way switch position, which is position four, they're out of phase, and you've got three different, completely different guitar sounds. Now the final mod, I did actually struggle to think of four, if I'm being honest. So this one is more of a versatility thing with a Telecaster and it is pickup configurations. And I don't just mean putting Seymour Duncans in it because you've been in a forum and everyone's getting a hard on over Seymour Duncans. Incidentally, this has a set of Seymour Duncans. They're the Seymour Duncan blackouts. It's less about the make of pickups and more about the type of pickups. So Telecasters generally come with two single coils. However, you can have a pick guard which has an extra pickup in the middle, or you can have a pick guard without any pickups in it. So you've just got the bridge. I believe that's a, an Esquire, Telecaster Esquire which is quite cool on its own. It makes you have to use the guitar more. You'll have to use your volume and tone knob, which will freak some people out. You can get a new bridge with a humbucker cutout. So you can put a humbucker in it. You can get a scratch plate with a humbucker cutout. You can even get a pit guard with a P90 cutout. That's like any combination of pickups with one, two or three pickups. You can literally do what you want. If you've got something like a Les Paul, mine's over there. If you put single coils on that, they look awful. But a Telecaster with humbuckers or a Telecaster with P90s, Telecaster with single, a Telecaster with any pickup. If you don't like the sound, change the pickup and it, it won't look any different. You just get a new pick guard. Pick guard's a tenor. It's just so versatile. You get tired of the sound of your Telecaster, go, well, 
What does a P90 sound like? Put one in it. Telecasters, they are the guitar that can do everything. My favorite mod by far is this control plate. I do it on every Telecaster I have, and I've done it to all my friends' Telecaster, it just makes it more playable. I've got a five-way switch in this one, I've done a four-way switch in another one. Five-way or four-way depends on what you're looking for and what you do, because a five-way can be a bit annoying if you accidentally put it in that outer face position live and all of a sudden it's got no output and sounds terrible. However, used in the right way, it does sound great, so you may not have that problem. Let me know if you don't. And as for pickups, it's just so versatile. You wouldn't think twice about a Telecaster having humbuckers or a P90 or single coils. It's, if it's got pickup, you think, yeah, it looks like a guitar. Whereas other guitars can't really do that. Leave a comment, let me know if this was helpful. If you've got any other ideas for mods for Telecaster, let me know what you've done to your Telecaster. It's really interesting finding out what people have done, even if it's ridiculous. You could have a Telecaster with a Strat neck you may just prefer the Strat headstock. Doesn't matter. I put links in the description and boxes up so you can watch the videos on how to do a four-way and five-way switch in more detail. Get one of these as well. There's a link in the description for that. Thank you for watching.